Today, Kevin and I are going to try two items that are new to us. These were both made in Mexico, uh, but I found these at Circle K Market. So it's just a random market and it's like, oh, well, we have never seen these things before, so let's get them. Um, I thought we would be adventurous. So uh, we're probably going to pronounce everything incorrectly, but the flavor is what matters in the end. It's the, it's the flavor, not how we pronounce it. Uh, you just got to get over it. It is a uh, Pulpogen Tahine Tamarind Flavored Soft Candy. Mine are Japan, J-P-O-N. Um, Not Japan, Japan. <laughs> dry Roasted Crunchy Chili Lemon Lemon uh, Peanuts Fuego. So, so mine are hot peanuts. <laughs> yes, so the, uh, uh, you wrote jalapeno. I know, what I'm, it said jalapeno on the receipt. So one of these was a dollar eighty nine, yeah. and one of them was two fifty nine. And I'm assuming that peanuts were the two fifty nine. The one. peanuts were probably the two fifty nine. Who knows? Yeah. But you, yeah, you truly don't. Because the receipt really didn't say anything. The receipt, it's one of those from a, a, a regular, you know, Circle K is like a Speedway or a Seven Eleven or something like that, and so they they give you the prices, but they don't like to give you the prices. Yeah, and the um, and the description of what the item is is just. Market. So I asked for a receipt, <laughs> and the first receipt he tried to give me didn't have any prices on it, kind of like the one you get at Speedway. It was just a receipt saying that your card was approved. Yes, and I said, can I have one with prices on it? And he's like, oh, okay. I mean, he gave it to him. It was no problem. But you have to be careful like that at Speedway. If you want the receipt so I can give you all prices, it's like I need to have those numbers. But, you know, they're not used to people asking for a receipt. Uh, it says uh, servings per container is six, and they're 68 calories each. So, okay. They're, are they individual? They're yeah. individual. Oops, so, uh, it's, it's soft candy. Here, you want to use this? It's beyond soft. Here. It's like smooshy. It's tamarind flavored soft candy. I think this is one you squeeze. No. Surely you just, it looks like it, it's not like jerky or Feel something. It. Well, you're going about it differently than me. Can I? Well, I was going to cut it and open it, but then I couldn't, I couldn't find a seam. Helps if I can see. You can tell we are not, uh, never had I'm this before. You, sweet. Okay, well. I don't know how you, how you'd eat it any other way. I mean, the packages are even really thick. Oh, you think? I don't know. There's no either other way to really eat it. There's no wrong way to eat it. That's right. See, it looks like. You think that's how you do? It? Yeah, you definitely don't stick. <laughs> your, don't stick your scissors down in it. <laughs> well, I was gonna it's try all, to it's open. Like a sticky tube. So you seriously squeeze it out of there? I don't know. It's only way I can think. People are going to be watching this going, <laughs> they did it so wrong. That is not the way you eat that. That's the only way I can see the mm -hmm. squeeze it. Ooh, it's got some heat to it. Well, we've had... We've had stuff that tastes just like this uh -huh. before. Yeah. I like the texture of it. This actually. I don't mind it at all. Um, we've had something that tasted like this before mm -hmm. that I didn't necessarily care for. I know. This is actually better. Mm -hmm. It's got a good spice to it. It's got a good texture to it. It's not, I think, um, the is it tamarind? Something like that. It's not too strong and overpowering. No. I think that's why I like this We've better. had it before, tamarind, in a drink mix. I think it was called like class or class or something like that. I think it's class, K-L-A-S-S, -S, I think. Um, anyway, we it, I think it was too strong in that drink, but I like it in this, and uh, I'll, there's a just a hint of spice to it. Yeah. I mean, just I mean, a it's, hint. It's, for me, it hit like really hot and it went away. My favorite thing, though, I mean, I really like the flavor. It's very enjoyable, but my favorite thing about it is the grit. Yeah, it has a gritty texture. It has a gritty texture to it. And it's really nice, but you all have to tell us a better way to eat it because it, I'm, even though I've rolled it up like this, 
it seems like I'm wasting a lot. Wasting there a still lot. is a lot it's still very, in that package. It's very sticky in the package. And I mean, are you supposed to have to just take your nail and just kind of work it up Push like it that? Up. Let us know because I feel like I'm wasting a lot doing because that. Because it doesn't tear. No, it's too thick and to I tear. can't even get my scissors down in it without it getting. You sticky. see, it stuck to that paper without it. No, it should sticky. be. There should be a way for you just to open it. So tell us, tell us how you eat that. Uh, but yeah, while you're reading about the peanuts. Other than that, I really like them. Yeah, um, see, it looks if they've got it just torn and squeezed up on the back. I don't know. I, I don't know. You see what I mean? Yeah, it's just torn down the side and they squeeze it up. I was hoping I'd be able to cut a slit, like cheese, right, like a block yeah, of cheese, and cut a slit up the side and open the whole thing. No, even the, and then eat it off the package. Like, like if you look at the package, there's a dotted line right there, and oh, there, this side goes up a yeah. little bit, so it's made to squeeze out. It's made to, but it's just really, really thick and sticky. So, do you think ours could be old, and maybe it was wasn't I supposed to be that sticky? I don't know. I don't know. Who knows? You'll have to tell us. I'm depending on you all to tell if me. If you eat it, you let us know. This is the Japan Dry Roasted Crunchy Chili Lemon Peanuts Fuego. Uh, it says Japanese style hot chili pepper and lime peanuts. Manufactured in Mexico. Uh, www.dosamigos-inc.com uh, um, These are three tablespoons there's about two and a half servings in the container is 160 calories good luck with those scissors i know i know i know it says easy open let's see how oh it was easy open there we go don't rip the whole side out yep, those are different they look up yeah they're crunchy yeah, it's got a shell on the outside. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's good. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I like that. I do have some little spice in them. You don't like that? You don't mind that lime? No, not at all. I don't. I don't notice it. I notice the heat. Pretty strong. Uh, I'll right. tell you what, the peanut uh, reminds me of. When we go to um, Texas Roadhouse, mm. and you, you, get them, you get them straight out of the shell, these taste like Those big, they've Because they've got them, that skin like flavor. Uh-huh. They taste like they've taken them straight from that shell. And my dad loves, oh, there's nothing he loves better than to buy a big bag of just shelled, salted peanuts. Uh, shelled and taking them out of the shell. He likes to sit there and watch his cowboy pictures and take the peanuts out of the shell and pop them in his mouth. That's he loves that. For me. I'd rather have them in a can and just put them out. <laughs> <laughs> they definitely have a different flavor though when you do it like that. Oh, I love it. Those are good. I think these are really, really good. Not so I'd buy all the time, but they're good. I could definitely snack on those all the time. And you know what? I actually really like those too. too. Yeah, I, if I was more skilled at eating it, I think I would like it more. Yeah, I mean, I think that's how you eat it. So. But I do like the grittiness to it. I like the um, uh, the tamarind flavor. Um, I think it's really, really good. Yeah, definitely worth trying it. Mm -hmm. So, if you tried either one of these, these are so unique. You have to let us know uh, because I've definitely never, never seen either one of these mm -hmm. any place. So I'm curious to who's watching this video that's had them and who hasn't. Um, I, I have some guesses, but I won't say. So anyway, I'll have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.